Laundry work is the process of washing, drying, finishing and storing household articles and clothes so as to maintain their original state. Click on the play button to view the video. For laundry work to be effectively done, you need sufficient laundry equipment. These include equipment for washing, drying, finishing, and storage. Click on each to view the equipment. Washing equipment includes buckets, basins, a laundry brush, washing machines, and boilers. A large sufuria can be used as a boiler. Drawing equipment includes a clothesline, pegs, drying racks, clothes horse, and various types of dryers. Finishing equipment includes irons, a calendaring machine, an ironing table or an ironing board, and a sleeve board. Storage equipment includes chest of drawers and a wardrobe, which may either be freestanding or inbuilt, suitcases, wooden or metal boxes. There is also improvised storage equipment which may include a carton box, a string for hanging items, nails on a wooden board on the wall, hooks on the wall, organizers or a cloth stand. A detergent is a substance used with water to remove dirt. Detergents are categorized into two. Soaps. Soap. And soap is made from natural products such as animal fat or vegetable oil and an alkali. Soapless detergents are made purely from chemicals such as petroleum byproducts. Laundry detergents come in different forms, which include soap cakes, soap flakes, bar soaps and powder soaps. These are different types of soap cakes. Soap flakes are obtained by pouring melted soap over rollers to cool it and then rolling it between metal rollers until it is paper thin. It is then cut using special knives into the required flakes. Bar soaps are available in different colors ranging from light yellow to light brown. They are good for washing all kinds of fibers. Soap powders are made from melted soap spread from nozzles. As the soap meets the air, it forms a fine powder which is collected and packed. These are substances other than soap that aid in laundry work. They include bleaches, starch, laundry blue, fabric conditioners, salt, vinegar, and solvents. Bleaches are used to whiten garments, remove some stains, and to kill germs.
starch, stiffens cotton and linen items, makes them glossy, gives them body, and makes them dart and crease resistant. Laundry blue whitens white items and brightens the colored ones. Fabric conditioner prevents static electricity, softens clothes, leaves clothes smelling nice, makes ironing easier, and reduces creasing. Salt fixes dye in loose colored items, removes some stains such as blood stains, breaks down mucus, and removes stains from soles of iron boxes. Vinegar brightens colored fabrics, removes ink stains, and over bluing. Solvents such as methylated spirit, paraffin, petrol, and home dry cleaner remove grease-based stains. They are also used for home dry cleaning. This refers to the series of activities carried out in the cleaning and maintenance of clothes. These processes include sorting, repairing, soaking or steeping, washing, rinsing, drying, finishing, and storage. The following video clip shows a person sorting out various clothes in preparation for washing. The following video clip shows a person fixing a hem. The following video clip shows a person soaking a white cotton tablecloth in cold plain water. The following video clip shows a person washing a white cotton tablecloth. The following video clip shows a person rinsing a white cotton tablecloth in cold plain water. The following video clip shows a person drying a white cotton tablecloth on the clothesline using pegs. The following video clip shows a person ironing a white cotton tablecloth. The following video clip shows airing a white cotton tablecloth. The following video clip shows a person storing a white cotton tablecloth. This can be done either by hanging or folding and then storing in a drawer. In this lesson, you will view the procedure of laundering various items, namely a tea-stained white cotton tablecloth, a fast-colored baby's cotton bedsheet, a loose-colored leso or kanga, a knitted woolen sweater, and a synthetic blouse.